our turnovers, I, I thought they um, did a great job as far as forcing some turnover up. But I, you know, for the most part, I thought we did a good job handling the basketball. But we got careless there. Um, you know, where we thought we went by them, but they were coming up from behind to tip it, and they went down and got some easy basket. Um, but you know, I, I can't remember if I called a timeout or not, just to try to get us settled back down and you know try to keep it close. And um, I thought we did a good job attacking their zone early. And then I thought they did a good job adjusting, and we it took we kind of lost our aggressiveness against the zone. You know, we we had we had a couple guys were driving it, be be um, attacking it aggressively, but then we also had some other guys that were being too soft um, by just catching it and reversing yeah. the ball. But um, you know, a lot of credit to Moorhead State. I think they're a well coached team. I think they're a tough team. Uh, you know, I, I watched both games with them versus Ohio State and Florida. And I thought they gave those two teams a pretty good run, you know. And you know they're a good ball team, and, and that's why I, you know, they're picked second in the league. And you know, hey, I tell you what, they're they're going to be tough to beat. Is is Ferrer? Is he as good a big man as you might see all year? Oh man, when you're putting up 25 and 20, and you know, and and again, that's on us. Yeah. Um, but at the same time, he did that the same thing against Florida and Ohio State. So he's 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 one of the best I've, I've seen. In, in the college, as far as I mean, he goes after every single rebound. He never takes a, a possession off, both offensive and defensive. He's he's really good. He's really good. Right, and I, I was I was asking David. I said, you know, playing get, having a guy like that that you're trying to box out all the time, <laughs> that's got to that's got to wear you down. Just just trying to to, right. to concentrate on taking him out of the game. Well, you know what? I told our guys this. I said, if you pick up a foul blocking out tonight, I'll congratulate you. And, <laughs> and you know what? I, I remember. Kevin Steinman, I think, was about the only one that picked up a foul blocking yeah. out. But he had another blockout where he knocked number 34 Goodman on his butt. And now the referee didn't see it to call it, but you know, again, I, he, you know, our guys were trying. They were trying, and and uh, Moorhead, they're just very so athletic, so tough. Attack the board uh, on on the on the glass on the offensive glass. Uh, uh, you know, they're just a good, very good team. Are you pleased with the way you guys came out of the gates, um, not having to work out of a big hole as we've seen. Just Past couple games. You know that that was kind of refreshing. Not 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 seeing that. You know our guys were ready to to um, to compete tonight, and you know what it all started from practice yesterday. You know it, we got after it yesterday in practice, um, and they brought that over to game time, and um, you know so it was kind of nice not trying to dig out of a you know 14 to old run or, or whatever it was a hole that we're you know we continue to fight out of. So that was kind of good that our guys were competing from the start. Yeah. Their, their coach said that you know Harper's capable of playing like that, but I mean he put up 35 tonight, which 22 is his career best. But you know maybe you're looking at Fareed to do everything, and sometimes that happens, and another guy gets hot too. No, you're you're exactly right. Um, you know our main focus was was Fareed. Not that we were um, forgetting about some other guys because we knew that for, uh, or um, we knew that Harper can do some pretty good things and can score and. You know, but but he he sh he shot it well. He shot it well from outside. I think he was like four for six uh, from the three. But he also drove by our guys. I mean, he drove it, got in there, got a dunk. He was aggressive, and when he he's aggressive and guys around on the perimeter are aggressive, it even makes it so much harder to guard Fareed one on one inside. You had a lot of 